Welcome everybody. We're going to be playing an XCOM playthrough on Legendary. So we'll go set this up. We're going to start at the Reaper HQ. Now the reason why is because uh, we're playing Iron Man mode. We're going to have all these integrated. And the reason why is because the mods that we have, it makes it very, very difficult to just accomplish anything. The game keeps crashing at certain points. Um, and I found that a lot of other people with some of these mods are having issues with these DLC missions. It's not causing any issues anywhere else. It's just these DLC missions. So turning these off should fix the issue. And we should just be able to play, our, play through how we want to with what we have. So with that being said, we're just going to start it up. And I will see you guys in the first mission. Continues to build as city centers across the globe prepare for the 20th anniversary of Unification Day. Thousands line up at the site of the Great Accord, celebrating the formation of the Advent Coalition. In keeping with their promise to humanity, 12 new gene therapy clinics will be opening in select cities by the end of the new year. Despite the attempted attack by fringe elements, operations at the new facility in Paris thankfully remain unaffected. In response to the unprovoked intrusion on the eve of our most beloved celebration, the speaker reaches out to us. A small number of dissidents again repeat the mistakes of the old world. Striking as we celebrate the benevolent savior who time and again offers only friendship and compassion. Yet these trivial actions could never break the bond between humanity and the elders. Peacekeeping forces have already made several preemptive arrests of known collaborators. Advent again assures all citizens that today's celebrations will continue as planned. position. You were right. Definitely got their hands full today. Stay focused. Prep gate crasher. 60 seconds. Alright guys, we've got Operation Gatecrasher starting it off. We got our four guys set up, ready to go, customized, looking like clone commandos and one Jedi set up. One of them's already a Reaper as we saw, we picked. And let's just go through her guys. So we've got myself, Killua, Sopsy, and George, who it keeps... I changed his name. It's supposed to be Fluffy Fruit here, right? But it keeps changing it to this Chris Edwards guy. I don't know who this guy is. But, um, now as you can see, we've got some extra stuff or whatever. So, our rookies are a little bit better off. We have, um, a better rookie light, which just gives, like, small basic stuff like this. 
Um, to counter it though, there's a lot of different enemy types that we've added, um, extra rulers, and then also as we progress in the game, enemy pods will increase. So um, at maximum, a pod will have three extra people for each pod that we encounter. So tech, it pretty much doubles the amount of enemies that we'll end up be fighting. So I think giving this little boost to help us a little bit early is not too big of a deal. Move our guys up slowly. So what my plan is that I want to do is I'm going to use the two claymores. One of them I'm going to use on the sectoid, and the other one I'm going to use on the trooper battalion. So that way we can hopefully weaken up a bunch of them and go from there. Oh no no no! no. Don't come too close though. Okay, okay, that's okay. I might use it... Hmm. Nah, I think I'll use it on the sectoid. Soon our prey will fall. Okay. Can use it here. Now I noticed that um, when you blow units up you can't salvage their bodies at all which I mean to a degree makes sense there now. but that's uh, the only downfall with uh, using the claymores like I'm going to be doing the first few missions are going to rely pretty heavily on the reaper just to kind of scout and that stuff um, otherwise you know there's really uh, there's not much you can do with just you know rookies uh. Move up as far as we can with everybody. Okay. Do I want to? Maybe I just use it on this group. <sighs> no, because I want to take out the if, half of the sectoid right now. That's kind of the ideal situation. Ah, oh. of course, like I had to have the loot. Okay, so I'm gonna move down a little bit. Um, let's go right here. I'm on it. Got it covered. So hopefully the sectoid will run over here. Ah, he's gonna revive him. It's not too big a deal, cause uh, we're gonna kill the sectoid anyway. For the, dead. the aliens have found a way to mind control them now. I'll watch closely. Eyes on the prize. Confirmed. Um. I think we just sit here like this for one more turn and let them all regroup with the, the captain squad there so we can throw a grenade and do as much damage as possible. There we go. Yep. Okay. Here's the ideal situation now. Roger. I've got my eyes on. Okay. So we throw the grenade. Really? You're not going to let me break the cover. That's fine, I guess. This is for you. Let's see how much we can do. Okay. Well, the four hit on the zombie, which doesn't matter, so that's tough. Let's see. Can we kill the captain? We can't. That sucks. Okay, so we need to kill the sectoid and the captain. So what if I come right up here? We 
kill the captain. Okay, he's been revealed. That sucks. Um, and the troopers are both down. Oh, he's in a bad spot. Okay, so we just come up here. Oh man. Well, that's uh, looking like Will is in a bad spot. Got the sectoid and the zombies down too. Um, who knows? These guys might just play weird. Okay, that's not very weird. Oh. That all you got? Wait. Okay. That is quite literally as good as it gets. Let's get up here on top of them. I need to reload. Okay. Here I come. Here's what we're gonna do. We'll take a shot here. Okay. Good. How many is that now? And then, oh, a conditioning. Okay. And so we've also got it where, when we kill enemies, they have a chance to drop items. Um, or supplies. And then, what we'll also see here is uh, we have the ability to, doing certain actions has a small chance to increase something, so mobility, or aiming, or hacking, or whatever. Um, and then we, if we also get, depending on how good we do in the mission, we can get bonus rewards. So, primarily will points and ability points. Um, I feel like if you do really, really well on a mission, it should boost morale. And that would be will points. So I think that that's a fair thing. We just cleaned this pretty good. And now you get bonus rewards for doing flawless missions as well. So nearby you find the remains of units from the original invasion. Cyber discs, floaters, drones, and other ant antiquated. Oh, I can't say that word. Junk. Among the wreckage, you also find something useful. Twelve Illyrium Crystals. Jeez. That's a pretty good start. I'm pretty happy with that. Advent officials announced an increase to this month's recruitment quotas. Citizens are encouraged to voluntarily visit their nearest recruitment center. Remember, only together can we build a better tomorrow. Sure, sure. Of course. Now we go through and we upgrade our guys. And now first we have Will, who is going to be our hacker. Oh, and he's gifted. Okay. So it's just gonna, the name states, Hacktivist. He's just going to focus on hacking over terminals and stuff. Oh, I didn't mean to. Okay. 1 HP, 5 Will. Okay. Okay, let's go back here now. Your soldiers. We have our Reaper, obviously. We may have chosen a different means of resistance, but our people fight for the same reason, for the world we once knew. Together we will end this occupation, or die trying. The resistance factions take okay. a more flexible approach to And now we can get both of these. It's because our soldiers are a little bit stronger, stuff costs a little bit less. But, I mean, that's not that big a deal. All right, now we have myself, and as I had stated already, as the Jedi. Um, There's been plenty I want to use about my flying, but I don't see anybody So else I think what I want to do is I'm not going to use these right away just because they're weaker. I think I'm just going to actually use just a sword for a little bit uh, until we can actually start upgrading a saber. Um, oops. Okay, that's not who I want. These are just our randoms that we have. Okay, here we go. Um, let's load up with this. And then we have Sopsy as well. And we've got him as a spec up. So he's going to be kind of a stealth guy as well.
so we can't use any of our sims yet but now we've only got four people here as well and this is just for now once we um get a few more missions in we'll start working on some other people i'm going to take people from my twitch community right now i've got three of my mods i still have four more that i need to add um and we'll add them as we go through stuff and then Commander, we will kind of go from there and if we need more people then we'll start adding other people from the community as well and we'll start with Shen here. Okay. Reworked your repulsors with some of the parts I salvaged from your old engine. Should fix that stabilization problem you had. Come on, Rover. It'll work. Commander! Getting our tech to talk to theirs is harder than you think. Lily Shen, Chief Engineer. At your service. You were probably expecting to see my father. In all that's happened, I'm guessing Central didn't tell you yet. He's gone. Dad gave everything he had to get us this far. This entire ship is his life's work. I know he would have loved to show you around the place himself. He used to talk about you a lot. You can be sure I'm ready to finish what he started. Might not look it, but from here, I can fabricate pretty much anything you come up with. And with a little more help, well, you'd be amazed with what I can do. It was an honor to finally meet you, Commander. All right, awesome. So here's where we can go to just build stuff. Um, <sighs> what do we want to build? I think I, I want to go with the flashbang because that can help with the sectoids early on. Impressive, isn't it? Capable of generating immense power, yet completely harmless to human life. If only the same could be said for the rest of the aliens' technology, Commander. Dr. Richard Tigan, Chief Science Officer. I am responsible for the entirety of our research here, as well as the procedure you so recently underwent. Welcome to my lab, such as it is. I'm not sure what Central may have told you, but we found something while removing you from the alien stasis suit. A device implanted directly in your occipital lobe. Had I access to the equipment available to me during my tenure at Advent, I would already know the precise nature of its function. However, given time and your approval, of course, Commander, I assure you, I will find out. Which brings to light an additional point. Though aspects of this facility are indeed impressive, I am but one man. Were you to direct additional support personnel and resources to me, I could substantially improve the speed of all our research. A farewell, Commander. Awesome. So we need to get some scientists to help him out. Now the first thing we're going to do is module weapons. And this is just going to basically make it so we can start putting attachments on stuff. <laughs> I do find that area and now, to be among we've the checked out the whole ship here. Available. Um, we'll and I guess you can kind of see the shooting range down here, but now it's just time to go to the bridge and get on with missions. Huh? Commander, good to see you on your feet again. Welcome to the bridge, the nerve center of our operation. The aliens have our entire world in their grip. Advent controls everything. Government, communications, industry, not to mention the military. And it's on us to take it all back. Resources and time are tight, Commander. It'll be up to you to decide how to best use both. The ship is yours. Awesome. Perfect. Let's go start getting some stuff then. Commander, seems like we actually managed to impress the Reapers. Their operative has just provided us the coordinates to their HQ. Now that we're in the area, it may be worth spending some time here. Not to mention meeting their leader, Volk. My people have thrown off the shackles of alien oppression. And through discipline, All right, we some have rookies. Survived. We don't rely really don't need any, but, you know, it's whatever. We would never live in their cities. We are the hunters. We move in the shadows. And we won't sleep until the last alien is dead at our feet. Commander, 
One of our resistance contacts just tipped us off to a site that may be worth new research. Commander, the Avengers remote scanning capabilities will help us search the area for And now we've got our lightsabers here. Again, we have to get a proving ground before we can actually start building them. So we're going to work on alien biotech and get there as fast as we can. Eager to begin, Commander. Catherine, Nicole, and Elizabeth. No. Oh, not, not now. Okay, an engineer. So we can get this engineer, and almost always the first real ops gives you an engineer. So week two, we can have two engineers. So. As the resistance continues to grow, okay. we'll have yep, a an engineer, hack the hitter. Okay, perfect. We've got our hacker too. As it is, we've already identified a potential so, with these first two missions, I'm going to use region. the same four. I'm not going to branch limited, off with anybody else yet. Um, I want to stick with these guys and... Oh, why did I put this weapon on him? I want to use them and uh, actually uh, get them a little bit of a higher rank. Try to get everybody to be a corporal, maybe. Um, and then start bringing in some newer people, just because if we try to split it up a little bit, stuff can go wrong, and we can uh, potentially lose multiple people if we don't. So we're just going to stick with these four, and then the next fight, we will end up bringing in probably, depending on what the mission is, probably one new recruit. of it she found something critical tied to the aliens latest operation unfortunately she only lived long enough to recover a fragment of the data we're moving to secure the area eliminate any alien forces nearby and hack that terminal before they manage to lock it down we need that data if we're going to stop their progress all right so we've got operation silent wolf neutralize all targets and hack the Psionic flow readings? Yeah. We've got our group again set up and ready to go. Now there's multiple sectoids that'll probably be here, and we got multiple melee units, so we should be okay. We'll just use our Reaper again to scout and see what we can find. I will reposition. Okay, yep, there's one. Okay, let's um come over here now. I am at your service. Okay, yep, there's the other one now. So let's uh Solid copy. That spotted me, really. Okay. That's not good at all. That's a tough way to start. Okay, we're gonna go with silent takedown. And we're gonna take this guy out, I guess. Wait, hold on. Okay, this is a seven and nine with a 30% chance to crit. Nah, let's just kill this guy for sure. Okay, when I said for sure, I was joking. Yeah. not revealed which is good but thing is is can I get into a spot where I can Fire actually order. shoot I can't okay Come get some. so this has gone about as bad as it can already okay and he's mind controlled so again that's really bad and he's spotted now. And you missed. Okay, this is just every... 
all possibilities that could have gone wrong have gone wrong so far. Okay. Okay, what are you going to do? Okay. I'm taking fire. Um. Uh oh. Are they really alerted? Okay, let's go up here. Yeah, 100%. There's no way you miss. It's 102%. Crap, 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 crap. Um, how do I do this now? I am trusting you. Okay, well. We got that guy at least. Stay hidden, please. Okay. All right, I'll go. Okay. Seven and nine. Possibility that we crit. Ah, damn it. Okay, so this is an awkward situation now. Let's see how this plays out. Uh oh. Oh. Uh, oh my gosh. Okay. Okay, we've got him back now at least. Okay, we have five turns left. Uh, As you order, Commander. I see everything. Finally. Okay. Covering. Hunker down. See how this works. Okay. So now I'll leave this here. Nope, no, 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 no. Do not throw another one. Just shoot this. Okay, I killed one. Damage that guy. We didn't destroy the roof, which I kinda wanted to, but it's fine. Okay, he's burning. Can I not? No targets available. What do you mean? Okay, let's come right here. Can I have silent takedown now? No. Okay, let's see what happens here. Hopefully, we don't alert another squad. Oh, okay. I got stuck here. Okay, good, good. Okay, so let's throw this grenade since we can't do anything else. Oh, and we got him in one hit. Okay, so let's move up now. Network is almost entirely locked down. Yeah, I know. We're running out of time. Get to that terminal. Okay, let's go up here. Says I am to obey. Okay, nothing there. Let's sit back a little bit when we search this one. These guys make up the bulk of okay. the we dealt with. We can get those guys with the claymore. Right? Well, uh, but they have a piece of armor. Of the exposed access point. We might not be able to. 
Can I hack from this far? Okay, I can't. Let's move over here. I'm going. Okay. Let's um just hunker down. Uh oh. Now they're coming up. What a shot. Wow. Okay. Well, now they know we're here. So maybe... Oh my gosh. You're qu oh, they're just going to split up like that, huh? Okay. We have two turns left, so I can I can do this. So first off, what I need to know is who you can get. Let's make sure we can get this guy first. Nice. How many is that now? Okay. Let's throw this claymore. I kill him? Okay, let's just go here. Did we kill him? I guess so. On the move. What? We really can't see him. Oh my. Come on, dude. Get ready for a surprise. Whatever, I guess. How do we not see this guy? So stupid, man. Okay, <laughs> let's hack into this. Huh? How does our first hack go? Um, reduced by 50% for four weeks. You know, we probably won't get it, but we got a 100% chance, so let's just go for the big boy. Ooh, that was pretty close. All right. Well, we got this. Now, how much hacking do we get? Uh, Bypassing security. Ah, got it. Three, okay. Perfect. And then, okay, we, we got the skill event, too. Good. Let's just get rid of this guy now. Oh. <laughs> nice extra kick. Okay. Operation Silent Wolf has been bested. We cut up... I cut up Will on accident. Um. So he's going to be probably down for like two or three weeks. But we are going to be bringing in some new people anyway, so I mean, I guess that's fine. Alright. What? 49 days? Okay, so we're never using Will again. Our soldiers is rated based on their understanding of our tactics and capabilities. Something we refer nice to knowing him. All right, let's see. Because of their unique experiences in the field, our faction soldiers from the resistance okay. will Use gain the first access to new abilities Always based hit. on this combat intelligence. That's minimal damage. Okay, well, so what does minimal damage mean? You know what? Let's just get the let's get the jump. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Then. 
Sopsy. What do we got here? One bonus damage for throwing knife and 10 aim when using them. But it's one additional throw. Sniper rifle, no. Does not trigger overwatch or reaction fire. Let's do the knife juggler. And then... Shrapnel. Always stay seen. Kill zone. Nah, that's too many points. Okay. So, Assault Trooper. Despite their heavy armor, the bodies have been Assault Troopers are distinguishable from regular troopers. Okay. Get two alloys, one supply, and a core. you once knew is no more its membership have all sworn loyalty to the advent administration with one exception it is good to see you again in the day since your capture i have done all i can to aid the resistance from the inside it was these resistance operatives that provided the intel leading to your recent extraction as of now Resistance forces are currently somewhat disorganized. If we are to defeat Advent and their alien masters, you must change this before it is too late. What you are seeing are classified reports of missing civilians from across the world. Their numbers are growing. We suspect they have been taken to a nearby Advent black site though its exact location remains unknown. Time is short, Commander. We need you to take charge of resistance operations throughout the world. Establish contact with the local cells and bring them into the fold. Find this black site and shut it down. Save our world. The clock is ticking. Good luck, Commander. Okay, so there's a lot going on. We're ready to move when you we are, got our engineer. I've updated our so, objectives based myself on the information. Let's see. You have done an outstanding job leading the Yeah, you know what? Let's commander. go for it. Commander, having these two soldiers continue to work together has paid off. They know each other well okay. enough at this point. Can't take shot immediately after going on Overwatch. Yeah. Additional tactical capability. Now that we have more um, staff on the engineering team, we can start cleaning I don't think up space that's beneath facilities, Commander. Necessarily, like, we the worst thing. For more recruits, though. We'll need them to staff the facilities once they're built. Okay. Alright, so I need to go Combat in here. Against the aliens day in and day I need to so change to Fluffy Fruit, because this is bothering me now. Takes its toll in various ways. We'll need to keep an eye on each soldier to manage their traits. Okay. So by the time... <laughs> I mean, <laughs> 49 days, wow. Okay. Not under my watch anyway. So, the let's just uh, get back out here and, and we aim to start working on stuff. Let's get that engineer again. forces in the area can get you into the site, but you will need to make contact with their network first. This is only the beginning, Commander. Your leadership will be a beacon to our people across the globe. Research based upon this simple design. If only I had known. Ah, Commander, excellent timing. There's been some progress. I've managed to break down several key components of the chip implanted into your skull. My analysis reveals that its primary function was that of a conduit, passing a vast amount of data directly to your cerebral cortex. With the primary connection severed, much of that data is lost. Several fragments do remain, however. Uh, ghosts, if you will. Observe. Tactical combat simulations. War games. The sheer volume of encounters you were processing was astounding. It... It is truly remarkable that you survived as long as you did. Though this may seem disconcerting, there is still some good news. This chip 
bears a striking resemblance to a medical implant I briefly assisted in developing at the gene therapy clinic in New Providence. My understanding was that the implants were intended for high-ranking advent officers only, captains or above. Retrieving a chip from such an officer would be the only way to know for certain. A greater understanding of these implants would undoubtedly benefit us all, Commander. All right, so we get to it. New objectives added. Okay. The Advent office is so we have our infirmary that we probably are going to have to build for well, and then we will start the Advent autopsy. Advent appear to be similar, if not physically the same as the common Advent trooper in terms of power and agility. However. Field reports indicate a more developed mental acuity, as the officers do provide tactical directives to the subordinate Advent forces. All right. Then we just go back to scanning and get this other engineer. There we go. Yif Ramirez. And we will use him and start clearing away some debris. Commander, so far I haven't seen anything critical among the alien components left over in this area. Ten days. Uh, if we clean this stuff I don't out, think that we will have the, space to the, new facility. the facility built by the time the next mission hits, which is unfortunate because I would really like to. Any second? Three. Ah. Yeah, we're too far away. Okay, what is this? Ice trappers? Okay, rescue stranded. They've retreated from the area, leaving only large amounts of lost. Okay. So, with this mission, if it's only lost, what we are going to do is we are going to get rid of everybody here, and we are going to have just Stopsy. He's going to lead a team of rookies. We will customize some people and get in some of our other mods, get them in, some experience going, hopefully get some good classes for them. But that is all for this episode. Uh, in the link the description down below, there'll be links for different mods that I'm using. If anybody has any questions about those or want to use any of them, um, if you don't want to look through the list and you're confused about which one or something like that, just go ahead and ask in the comments and I'll respond and help with it. I'll have my Twitch channel there where I'll be streaming other stuff too. You can come hang out. Um, and yeah, um, that's kind of it for now. I appreciate everybody for watching, and I will talk to you guys in the next one.